Hello everyone, here's a question. The length and breadth of a rectangular piece of land are 500 meter and 300 meter respectively. Find, they are asking two things. One is its area, second is its cost. If 1 meter square of land costs rupees 10,000. So first we have to find out the area. Based on area, we are going to find out the cost here. And we have, it's a direct question. We have given the length and breadth value. We are going to find out the area and the cost. So here they have given length which is... 500 meter so this is 500 meters and they have given the breadth which is 300 meter first we find out the area this is first question so area formula we know area is length into breadth it's direct formula so length here is 500 so 500 meter multiplied by breadth is 300 so 300 meter now multiply them. So 3 into 5 or 5 into 3 anything. Just multiply the numbers. 3 5 is 15. And you can see we have two zeros here, two zeros here. So put those zeros here. We will get four zeros. And it's meter into meter. It will become meter square. That's it. We got the area. Now second question here is we have to find out its cost. And they are charging per meter square. They are charging 10,000 rupees. Now they have given 1 meter square is equal to rupees 10,000. So, how many meters are there? You can see we have uh, 1,50,000 meters here. And for 1 meter, it is 10,000. So, we have 1,50,000 meters, which means to find out the cost here, we have to multiply this 1,50,000 with 10,000. I hope it's clear because 1 meter square is 10,000 rupees. Okay. And here, how many meters we have? We have 1,50,000. So, to get the total value, we have to multiply this two to get the answer. So let's find out. So total cost will become. So we're going to have a lot of zeros here. Total cost is equal to. It is 1 lakh. Okay, 1 lakh 50,000. Multiplied by. Rupees 10,000. If it was 2. If it was it was 2 meters. It will be 10,000 plus 10,000. Which will be 20,000. If it was 3,000. Uh, 3, uh, so if it, it was 3 meters. It will be 10,000 plus 10,000 plus 10,000. Which is 30,000. Or you can simply do 3 into 30, three into 10,000. Which will be 30,000. Instead of adding it. We are multiplying here. We cannot add it 1,50,000 times. Right. So it is better to multiply. Now if you multiply. You are going to have a lot of zeros here. So 15 into 1 is 15. And then you have four zeros here and four zeros here. So total eight zeros you will get. So it is a huge number. So that's it. So here's a small task for you. How do you going to say this number? So we have a lot of zeros here. Try to say this number. What are you going to call it? Like it's a how many millions or billions it is. So comment this. I'm going to say if it's correct or wrong. Thank you so much.